Hello, in this video I will show you how to work with LUT Cloud in 3D LUT Mobile. If you have a license for 3D LUT Creator, I congratulate you, because you will get almost unlimited possibilities for color correction in your phone. You can upload your own presets in it. And in this video, I will show you how to do it. To set the connection between 3D LUT Creator and 3D LUT Mobile and get the ability to upload your own LUTs, you will need to log in to LUT Cloud in both programs. I'll start with 3D LUT Creator. I open Preferences. On Integration tab, you will need to enter a password for a personal account. Done. Now in 3D LUT Mobile, you need to open Preferences and click Login. Here, I will enter my login data. Done. So, what does such integration do for me? Firstly, I can send photos from the application to 3D LUT Creator. I have a few photos from the night shooting, and now I'll make my own preset for them. I'm opening the photo in the app, clicking check mark at the top and selecting Send to 3D LUT Creator Desktop. Now in 3D LUT Creator, in the File menu, I select Import, Import Image from 3D LUT Mobile. See, the photo from the phone has opened on the computer. Of course, both devices must have internet access. You can view LUTs from the cloud through Look Manager in 3D LUT Creator by clicking on the globe icon. Here are the LUTs from 3D LUT Mobile app. All LUTs which I create for personal use will appear in My LUTs folder. It is empty now, let's add something here. For this photo, I will make color harmony of blue and red. To do this, I reduce color temperature to get blue. Then I move the tint slider to get red. I will go into the channel mixer and pull the blue and red points apart to further strengthen the separation of colors. I move the darken slider to the left to exclude the effect on colors that have become darker. I will reduce the saturation threshold in case some channel may get clipped. I recommend watching my lesson about channel mixer for those who have questions about it. On the Curves tab with the red channel curve, I'll remove the red color from shadows. I'll set the black point and adjust the contrast with the help of the master curve. Using Sat Luma Curve, I will increase the saturation in the shadows and decrease it in the highlights. I will try to make the jacket neutral. To do so, I reduce saturation of unsaturated colors on the Sat Sat Curve. To improve the result, I changed the color model to LAB. The skin became pale, so in the channel mixer, I will add red. On the AB grid, I will make the skin redder and more saturated. This is before, this is after. I upload this preset into the cloud. On the file menu, I select Export, Submit LUT to Online LUT Storage. Here, I can name the LUT. The short name is needed to display in the app. I will leave it as it is, it should fit. I'll write down my tags. In the comments, I will indicate white balance that I use to shoot. This preset will be accessible only by me. Before uploading the preset, make sure to review the terms of use of the cloud. Violation of some of them may entail a ban or even a loss of 3D LUT Creator license. I click OK. LUT is uploaded into the cloud. I will open it in Look Manager. Here it appeared in my folder. What options are available for my LUT? I can open it in the program, load it as an external LUT, reset all settings, and also load it as an external LUT. I can delete it, and I can change something in 3D LUT Creator and update this LUT in the cloud with my current settings. I'll go to the phone and see how this LUT will work in the application. I open My LUTs folder and here it is. I'll add a bit of sharpness and saturation. LUTs are applied after basic adjustments, so with the help of white balance, I can change the ratio of red to blue. I save the image to the gallery. That's what happened. I'll make LUT for one more shooting. These photos were made by Maxim Guselnikov on the phone. Special thanks to him. I will send the photo to 3D LUT Creator. I will grade this photo in Fargo style. Here is a reference I will use. 
It can be seen that the reference contains toning and it is better to reduce saturation before applying such toning onto this photo. Now, on the Curves tab, I extract the curves from the reference and apply them to my photo. I smooth them out a bit. On Master Curve, I set black and white points and adjust contrast. The photo already looks good. On the grid, I'm going to increase the color variability by raising the saturation of blue. I'll change the green color to darker and colder. I will also adjust the skin tone. Done. Compare before and after. I'll upload the LUT into the cloud and name it Fargo. I go to the app and apply my LUT. That's what happened. This is before. This is after. Thus, in your phone, you can use all the functionality for working with color, which is in 3D LUT Creator. I'll load another photo from the shoot and apply my LUT to it. That's all. You've learned how to upload your LUTs to the cloud and apply them in the 3D LUT mobile app. Now, your search for color is unlimited, not only on your computer, but also on your phone. In the next video, I will use a color target and create several profiles for my phone under difficult shooting conditions. See you in the next video.